Hello, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 12, that I've worn the same sweater. So did I intro all these in the same day? No, but does anyone know that? No, does anyone care? Even though more, no. All right, I can't fully understand why, because we've learned so much about how to do things right, and I just, it's almost like a joke. It's like, are you doing this wrong to give us an exercise to teach us how frustrating the world's gonna be? Because it almost seems like the only way this many things could go wrong is if it's being de done deliberately. But then, you know, upon talking to like, m smarter people than I am, um, no, this is just how the world works. Like, that's just like, that's why we're gonna have jobs one day. In this situation, I called around to the rest of my cohort and was like, hey, is this right? And they're like, absolutely not. And I was like, good. So my initial assumption was correct. It's gonna take them a while to undo it, I know, like, just cause it's so hard to, you know, register people for courses. I don't wanna spend vlogmas doing this because I wanna just have a video later discussing kind of the ugly unfold. And after explicitly stating when my start date was, they still think I'm, like a year behind so that's like no I didn't know it's not right fix it <laughs> today's my last day of Thursday work and I have one more day tomorrow before Kristen gets here but this is good I'm handling things better than I usually do because I'm just talking through it like here also last night we went on a really really fun double date and it was really really nice and I that's why I didn't really edit last night at all so today's video is gonna go up a lot later but obviously I didn't film the double date because I'm just like, you know, I'm just having a good time. But I had a really great time, so did Tommy. Like, they're really nice people and we don't have many couple friends here especially. So it's really, really nice that we got to do that. And just when you meet people and it was weird because we were so similar. Like, I was very similar to like her and Tommy was very similar to the guy. So it just like was a weird like click right away in terms of like what we have in common. So that was funny <laughs> and yeah. We'll probably hang out again after the new year since we don't have much time now since I have a visitor and I go home. Visitor meaning Kristen, I can name her on the vlog. It looks like it's also snowing. I think it is. Like if it won't show up on the camera, but basically there's like larger. Um, it looks like rain, but like bigger. Great description. Hey, so I just got back. I went to school quickly. Nobody was there, obviously, because where would they be? And um then I decided to go back to my practicum site because I, to be honest, I love being around a lot of the people there, so I decided to just go. Um, because one, I did leave something there from yesterday, so I went to go pick it up. And when I was there, I just ended up staying for an hour and just chatting with people. It was like really nice. So basically, I'm back now and I have to leave for work in like I don't know, an hour or so. I'm gonna edit today's vlog and I'm gonna watch some Vlogmas. And I called Kristen because she shows up tomorrow, which is incredibly exciting. So we were talking through her different like flight things and everything she needed because she's only flown like twice in her life. The first time she was like really really little, and then the, all the time, or the second time after, and the third time after, we're all on trips that I was with her for, for when we were swimming in college. So it was pretty funny. I'm gonna have to like help her and talk her through some of the stuff for tomorrow, but it's gonna be great. It's gonna be so fun. And when she gets here, we're gonna have such a great time. So I'm so excited to have a friend in town. Like it's just gonna be so nice to do all of the holiday festivals. Words. I am headed to work now and I don't have food again because we don't have any food but if there's a bunch of treats today I will definitely vlog those and I gotta go. I was considering not even vlogging this but I feel like I need to because of like what happened yesterday just a little bit. Last night I kind of had like a little bit of a mental stress breakdown and I couldn't really figure out what it was. We had a really great night and after I ended the vlog last night, well after Tommy did, I my heart rate just went up. I just started to feel really like sick and really terrible and I couldn't really figure out why and I just felt like crap and I just didn't, I was just so confused <laughs> and I didn't like that feeling. So um, I tried to relax and calm down and I did. So I didn't end up pacing all night like I used to when I got stressed. I just kind of like was um, sitting there and then 30 minutes later I was like okay I'm okay so I went to bed and then that was that like September to December right now has been amazing for me because I've been coping better with things and dealing with things in a more effective way than I used to but it's like things sometimes still hit me really hard and then I end up being really really anxious and upset and there's nothing even happened yet yesterday but I just started to feel really like terrible and it's like I knew there was gonna be a breakdown today of some kind. Okay, last thing I wanna say about this because 
I didn't think this was gonna be like a mental health typey vlog, but it turned out to kind of be that. I really wanna be better with coping with things that are stressing me out. I don't wanna become this frustrated every time something goes wrong because things will always go wrong but i've grown so much in my ability to handle other things like this is just one thing that's just repeatedly occurring that is just getting the best of me but i've gotten so much better at handling other situations that have come my way that i'm still so proud of how i face conflict but there are just certain things that make me so upset and when those happen, I just that that's when I just get really, really stuck. And that's what's happening today. Like, my stomach is in knots right now. I'm not happy with, like, what I'm currently needing to deal with. But I just need to realize it's, this, it's reality. And I can't react this way every time something like this happens. Like, I just need to treat it like, a, oh, haha, ha, someone's being, like, stupid and bad at their job again. And that's it. Like, move on to the next thing. Because it's really so taxing on me. And nobody else is, like holding it this way right that's involved in this like it's, it's hurting me and hopefully being around the kids and having some like happy times will put me back into like normal me mood when it comes to holiday stuff because I hate having to be this way around Tommy and I hate just being like down like I said I've been so much better but I've just been so when I get down about this specific issue that I can't do anything about it pulls everybody else down and that's not fair so I want to be better than this Panda, trash panda. Oh, he's so big. His little friend. Oh, they have a little nest in there. Oh, oh my God, there he goes. Hi, friend. It's okay. Bye. I think I just missed my bus. Bye, buddy. It's okay. Oh, look at him. Oh, he looks like a puppy, obviously. They're all waiting for you in there. Honestly, that's like the biggest raccoon I've ever seen. Oh, bye. I'm back from teaching. I'm doing a little better. That was a nice like mental break for me based on the conversations I had beforehand. But I had some students give me some cute cards. So that was a nice, I'm just covering her name. But this is so cute. This girl's like six. And I don't get to teach her again next uh, session because I'm not teaching on Thursdays next session and a lot of people keep the same days because it just works for them all year. So it's so cute. She's so little. Um, I will say she does have an S in her name and she wrote the S. She's like five or whatever I said. Well, this is so cute. This one just has my name on it. It's got a lot of stickers. I don't even know who gave me this one. So, uh, oh wait, no, I do. All right, so. We have a little, oh, 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 a gift card for Starbucks. I don't know how I'm looking. Okay, Merry Christmas. A little drawn house. That's nice. A little letter. Clearly written by her parents. <laughs> Dear Alicia, thank you for helping me with my swimming. Merry Christmas. I love it. When I was little, I did the same thing with cards. I would just like fold them like this and make it like, this is so cute. So yeah, two really cute cards, some really nice kids. New Starbucks card. Oh, it's 10 bucks. So yay. Oh, that was so nice. Oh. I can start it. There we go. See? Look, I did it. Yay. Hey. Now look at yourself. It's the, it's the end of day 12. You sound like not. That's what I'm going for. <laughs> it's the end of day 12. Look at yourself. Oh, boy. Spooky. Very spooky. Very spooky. The end of the day. Is the end of the You were right. 12th day of the month. Let's see, 12th day of the month. Yay! Yay! Yeehaw! <laughs> what if I just start going back into into my twang accent? How's that do? Right. No? I don't think so. If I just kind of perpetually kept on doing it, would it become a nuisance? You do lack accents, after all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't need that one, but like, that's fine. If that makes you happy, who am I to tell you otherwise? It's a long outro. It is. <laughs>